Hi Esther. Hello Laura. <laughs> I w wanted to ask you about um, Theatre Ramba Samba. How, yeah. how is it uh, founded? Yes, uh, Ramba Samba was founded in the 1990s uh, from Gisela Höhne and her husband Klaus Erfurt. They had a son with Down syndrome Moritz and decided that they want to make a theatre for him. And this is Theatre Ramba Samba, Germany's most popular inclusive theatre. Who are you? Hi. Hi, Aaron. <laughs> You're Aaron? Yeah. Hi, Hi Aaron. <laughs> Hi, Aaron. Nice to meet you. Yeah, you too. What are you doing here? I'm an actor. I'm not his mom. <laughs> this is Gisela Höhne. As you see, here are our actors. Okay. They are having lunch, relaxing a bit during the rehearsals. Mm -hmm. And on the walls, you see wonderful pictures and um, yeah, artworks from our actors and other artists of Ramazan. Where are we going now? Uh, when he comes, he uh, goes uh, up uh, upstairs. <laughs> These are our choreographers and our voice builder, <laughs> voice educator. Okay, so, so there are a lot of there are lot of oh, voice educator. <laughs> so there are a lot of people today uh, in the house. What will take place today in the afternoon? What will you do? We will have a main rehearsal for our next show. Okay. It will be the first evening tomorrow. It's a play for children. And this is our costume and mask uh, designer. Uh, <laughs> Hi, nice Hi. to meet you. <laughs> Her name is Beata. Hi, Bea. Hi. <laughs> our main stage. What was the push or the motivation for the creation of Ramba Zamba? The creation is a human being. Mm -hmm. He was born 40 years ago <laughs> and his name is Moritz and mm -hmm. I was an actress and uh, the father of Moritz was a director and so one day we discovered the the talent of Moritz mm -hmm. as a player, an actor, as an artist. And so I started when he was about 10 years old to work with uh, young children. Mm -hmm. um, we, did this, we made a circus and um, it was very clear that there is a big treasure hidden in them, in many of them. And so we started after the wall broke down. Mm -hmm. This is big uh, art uh, workshop and also with the theatre. These artists really are very, very good and surprising good. Mm. And that they are on the stage, the, art, the actors are on the stage really like lions. They are uh, uh, loose from the line and then they, they play and act, it is uh, really great yeah. and they have a deep truth in themselves and um, they want to work, they are uh, strong mm -hmm. and sensitive and so our hope that um, they would be able to do this was fulfilled totally. Mm -hmm. um, what, they, what they do is a high quality, mm -hmm. it's really theatre, prof professional theatre and not uh, some uh, social work. And the other is that we also found um, the, the financiation. Mm -hmm. It was a hard fight. It was not, not just an accident. Mm -hmm. um, but uh, we could reach that uh, the government of Berlin gives a lot of money. It's the most money from all Germany, which uh, which is given for such a theater. Yeah. There are not so many bad uh, experiences. 
you have to face your own uh, unability every day. Mm -hmm. To um, this is the most hard thing that you so fight for the real true expression with them, and to see that you are limited and and also limited in in, in energy, but. You come out every time, and this is the big luck then. <laughs> um, why, in your opinion, theatre world is not yet fully accessible and inclusive? Uh, I think this has many reasons. Uh, it has no tradition, mm -hmm. and the, maze, the most pieces or uh, plays are not written for people with handicap. Yeah. And uh, when you have especially mentally handicapped or very strong bodily handicapped people, they are always on the stage to recognize. And there's a, a sort of self, um, self advice. You, you, you cannot say, um, you cannot think they are not there. They are different. Mm -hmm. And so the, you have to make the show so that you forget it. Yeah. And um, this is in the moment still not Uh, um, usual mm -hmm. in the normal theater. Mm -hmm. The structures are not there, the, the, the roles are not there, and um, also the thinking is not so open to think that um, also Julia can have Down syndrome. take for a disabled person to become an actor? How do you know this person can become an actor? Uh, th this is not easy mm -hmm. because you need m much time and um, you, because they are um, different in their development than other so-called normal actors and you have to give them time mm -hmm. and you have to give them the right conditions to, to come out. There can be one person, one year, nothing happens. Mm -hmm. And you think, okay, let it be. And suddenly, there is just, it opens, and this person uh, comes out. Like we have one, Zora, she was many years, we thought, mm, yes, she looks like uh, exotic and anyhow, but she cannot play really big roles. But uh, with the time, she became stronger and stronger. Um, and uh, also because anyhow she felt that we still believe in her mm. and then we gave her a bigger role and buff, she was there yeah. and she plays big roles now and she is so sh uh, shining person now also yeah. privately yeah. um, could you give an advice for someone who wants to become an actor The, the most important thing is to, that you want to play in, for, in every case. Um, and that there is, the wish is so strong that you would give up every weekend for it. You, the birthday of your uh, grandparents, the birthday of your best friend, you say, no, you can celebrate, I will go on stage and play. And um, then not give up. Not give up. Again and again try and go, go on the nerves <laughs> to the people who give the role. Say, I want, I would like, I want to show you, I have prepared. Then you have the attention and uh, uh, the director will say, I tried. Because he or she wants really. <laughs> Is it important for organizations like Ramazama to be globally connected with similar initiatives? Um, it is to wish. You don't have to grow international or national to other cities or, or with other theaters, but it is time because of the inclusion. But um, there is a logic in our project by itself already. Mm -hmm. and, and, but so also it is strong enough to expand and to say we want to exchange because we want to grow to be better and to learn still more. Mm -hmm. For this, this is important, to okay. get more, um, um, input? more input, fantasies, creativity from others yeah. and, and to exchange and so to develop. For and this is always developed for artistic uh, yeah. 
projects. And also to give maybe others inspiration oh, also, also. because it's a role model. Yes. I don't know if something like Rumba Zamba mm -hmm. exists anywhere mm -hmm. else in the world. Mm -hmm. I don't, I'm not sure. Yes. And last but not least, would you consider visiting Greece for a Rumba Zamba? Oh, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> in every case. It's the uh, it's Vige, it's uh, the first the, uh, yeah. day of theater. <laughs> it's in, in Greece. In, and and um, the origin. We studied it and we love it. And uh, I, I, did, I made uh, Medea as a performance. And so we had um, Sophocles. And yes, we would come immediately. Yeah. <laughs> so, okay, guys, watch out. We are coming to Greece. <laughs> Thank you, Didier. <laughs>